welcome to Once More to Mathematics Pro. So today we are going to solve square root of third. So to solve this, you want to make sure that your equation should be in this form. The square root of a plus and minus to the square root of b. So your equation has to be in this form before you're going to use this method that I'm about to show you, the most easiest method. Okay, so to do that, if your equation is in this form, we have to, for A, we have to think of two numbers that when we add them together, it will give us A. And when we multiply the same two numbers together, it will give us B. So if you have those two numbers, then your answer will be the square root of M plus the square root of n. Now in case of minus, you have to write the value that is greater first. So if m is greater, if we have minus, we are going to have m minus the square root of n. But m should be greater than n for the case of minus. So if you got it, let's move to this, our first question. So in our first question, we can see that a is the same as 8, and you see we have 2 here and 2, and b is the same as 15. So we have to think of two numbers that when we add them together, it will give us 8. And when we multiply the same two numbers together, it will give us 15. Now what are the two numbers that when we add them together, it will give us 8? So a is 5 plus 3. 5 plus 3 is 8. And also 5 times 3 will give us 14. So everything is perfect. So we have the two numbers. So our answer will be equal to the square root of 5 plus the square root of 3. So this is our answer now let's move to the next question now looking at this question right we can see that we have two here is in the form but we don't have two in front of the square root of 108 so how can we do that in order to have two in front we should not forget that the square root of 4 is equals to 2 so we are going to make a multiple of 108 using root 4. So this can be written as we have 12 minus multiple of 108 if we want to use it as a product of 4. So we are going to have the square root of 4 times the square root of 27. The square root of 4 times the square root of 27 will give us 108 square root of 108 so if we move further we are going to have the square root of 12 minus the square root of 4 will give us 2 so root 27 so now it's in this form but here we have minus as well so next we have to think of two numbers now when we add them together, it will give us 12. And when we multiply these two numbers together, it will give us 27. So the two numbers are 9 plus 3 is equal to 12. And 9 times 3 is equal to 27. So if we look at these two numbers, which one is greater? 9 is greater than 3, right? So to write our answer, 9 has to come first. So firstly, we are going to have the square root of 9. Since we have minus, we write our minus, the square root of 3. If we want to simplify this further, our answer will be the square root of 9 is, of course, is 3. So minus root 3. So this is our answer. Let's move to the last question. So looking at this last question, all right? So instead of two, we have 10. So to make sure that we should have two, we all know that um, 10 
ten is also ten can be written as two times five or two times the square root of twenty five right because we have two the square root of twenty five would actually give us five which is also the same as ten so instead to write ten I can write it as two root twenty five so let's answer this question now so we are going to have 30 plus instead of 10 as I said before we are going to have 2 root 25 times root 5 so if we move further this will give us 30 plus 2 because we want to make sure that 2 is here then 25 times 5 will give us root 125 so next we see have to think of two numbers that when we add them together it will give us 30 and when we multiply the same two numbers together it will give us 125 so the two numbers are 25 plus 5 is 30 and 25 times 5 will give us 125 so to write our answer we are going to have the square root of 25 plus root 5 what's the square root of 25 is 5 so our answer will be equal to 5 plus root 5 that's it so please do subscribe thanks for watching